Imagine this, if you will, a classroom where learning comes to life. Rather than reading about an historical event, students could actually be immersed in it. That technology isn't far away. One Utah teacher showed us how the AI revolution is already helping her get creative in the classroom. School's out for the summer, but inspiration is firing. Oh my gosh, I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I love it. Teacher Laura Bettison is experimenting with artificial intelligence. She asks a bot to take a math problem from boring to fun. Its answer? I can play math wizard with exponents and the number 10 to easily handle big numbers. Picture this. 10 to the power of 2 means 10 times 10, giving you 100 in total. She says AI aced the assignment, perfect for her fifth graders. I don't want to hear the word utilizing exponents when I'm 10. I want to hear about the math wizard. Mrs. Bettison also uses AI to save time on her own planning and prep, and she's not alone. A new study from the RAND Research Organization found 18% of teachers use AI in school. The top uses? tailoring a lesson to fit their students levels and generating quizzes and assignments even as we were here talking she designed a math lesson in seconds that would have taken an hour she says this technology frees her up to do what she does best build relationships with students technology cannot replace the relationship that is absolutely crucial number one vital thing before learning can happen her idea to use ai came from a relationship closer to home inspired by her daughter mia Mia showed us how she uses AI to interview historical figures. Her subject today, Amelia Earhart. Well, she's really brave. Mia wants to learn more about life aboard a tiny plane. What did she eat and drink? For long flights, I packed simple, non-perishable foods like hard-boiled eggs, sandwiches, and fruit. Helping a classroom come alive in new ways as technology advances. Maybe even allowing students to speak at some point with a realistic AI model of Amelia Earhart. Let's teach them how to use the tools right here in class. The ones that they're going to be using probably for the rest of their lives. Yeah, isn't that crazy? That's the case. The state school board released guidance on AI this year, saying it has benefits and risks that must be thoughtfully managed. It says schools should allow students to develop their skills, but keep security measures top of mind. In addition to what it's doing in our classrooms, our AI Revolution series covered everything from how to spot a deep fake to how you can use AI to protect yourself from scammers. If you missed any of our series, you can find them all on our website, ksltv.com, as well as the KSL Plus app.